one guys um, in this one I'm going to show you how to draw multi view in three different dimensions then for an example you have pictures here like six pictures here I'm going to show you how to draw it as engineer, engineering drawing like a left hand like front side top side and the right side so let's start so we have this book here so I'm going to draw this number 35 so first before we draw anything we draw the front side so if you see the front side the, uh, I don't have the graphical sheet so I choose this one I hope you will understand um, if you see the front side it's three boxes in the bottom so I'm going to draw this like mind measurement three boxes here and it's two boxes upside two boxes upside and it's connecting this connect this line is connecting and also if you see uh, the top is fully covered so if you uh, actually it's we can draw a square actually if we count how many square total one two three four five six so we can uh, double this size let's say this is six and the square is going to be this long and it's divided by half each by uh, this line each by this line so this is going to be our front view so if we want to draw a top view i'm going to leave it uh, draw the top view on top so it's going to be four boxes long and six boxes wide so you have to make sure it matches with the uh, front sides long so it should be exactly the same as front side and top side is this six boxes long and if we count that uh, one two three after that you know, the size is reducing so first I'm going to draw three line exactly same as the line here I just line here and divide it in half then I'm going to draw the straight line and connect it also we had to also we had to show this this one here the line that divide because from this line if you imagine the dimension is changing so therefore we had to draw this line so this is going to be starting from here I'm going to connect the bottom so this is our, this is our top, top side picture and to draw the right side picture right side we have to draw a 45 degree line let's say this is the 45 degree line I'm gonna extend it as uh, more than that top line picture so we can see exactly where it's gonna cross so if I extend this one here this is gonna be here right here and if I extend this one here it's going to exactly come right here so if we see from the right side from this side we stand and look at this from this side we are going to see only this four square four boxes four line boxes this is going to look like two box two box height square two box height square and also um, we will uh, also see the dimension change so for example from the middle it's divided so here we go we divide this part into two part and also we divide this part into two part so we divide this one into two part and middle there's a line so that's how we divide this one and this is our first picture 
we are done. So let's go to our second picture. <clears throat> second picture, this this one. So if we count this one um, from the front side, we have to see the total boxes. So I am gonna count it from the top. It's easy to count right from here. One, two, three, four, five, six. So I'm gonna go six long. Six, six box. Six box long line. Right here. So let's say this is six uh, box long, and the height is gonna be like one, two, three, four, five, five box height. Five box height, and the length is gonna be two box, two box length, and three box deep, then two box length, and then three box deep again, then two box length again, and it's ending. So let's say this is the this is a picture. This is a picture of a round sun. So what I'm gonna do is um we have one more thing to do in the middle. If you see the diamonds is changing from this middle, so I have yet I have to draw that line to show the change. So we are done with the front side. If we draw the top side. For the top side, um, the length is going to be same, only the, the depth is going to be different. So, first, if we start from here, uh, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. So, 6 centimeter long, 6 is about as long, and 2 centimeter depth, 2 box depth, and the depth should and it's coming for box depth here right here and then this is we can draw the back part as a straight line it's going slightly more much like this so from here one box deep one box deep and from that it's gonna be straight like that and from this there's a diamond something so we have to so separate that here and this is gonna be this is gonna connect right here it's gonna connect so this is our top side so to draw the right hand side I'm gonna draw a 45 degree line here So let's see, it's, uh, it should start from here, so I'm going to connect this line. And we should extend this part. Okay. And this line. So from the back side, it's going to be it's gonna look like a straight square. Let's draw that. This much long, this much height, as this one, and this much height again. So the only thing we have to show the separation is right here. So if we draw this line right here and here. Okay, from this one dimension change. So it's actually three books, three books long, three books long, and uh, from that uh, actually this one four books long. So they are for they are going to be a small thing. One box is going to show from here. We have to show that this much have quite one box is showing, and after that. It's gonna be a straight line. 
then Chrome what else we have to show we have to show the hidden line here because after this part is hidden in the back side so we have to show that hidden line here and that's it that's it for this one so we are done with the second picture Let's go to the third one. The third one is gonna be this one of four four boxes of deep and four boxes height. Four boxes deep, four boxes height, and it's its length is six zip from the back side. This and this connects mm, two from the two. There's a connection here. Two to four. There's a connection. And the next connection is four to. Actually, this one should be about okay, four to six. So this is why it's important. Sometimes we make a mistake. Okay, let's try this one. Four to six. On the back side. So therefore the top part is going to be like this for depth for log six log six log mm, two and connect this one and two more. Mm -hmm. And uh, if we draw it right side, like 45 degree, I'm going to draw 45 degree right here. Square box four, four. So we draw this part and let's go to the next one. Mm, five more. Yeah. Okay. Mm -hmm. okay. So front side, I'm gonna put the front side first, it's a uh, five square log one, two, three, five, and one square length and two square long again. Then it's kind of one square extended right here, and then one square long, then one square extended. So this is gonna how it's gonna look like. <coughs> mm. And then this one has to be extended for square again um, it's connected from this one mm. 
after that after that it inclines like this all the way to the end and this is our front side if you look at the top side here it's going to be like five boxes uh, five boxes down and five boxes long here too and three boxes deep then all the way back here one box is long three boxes deep three boxes deep and the top side actually is um actually this one the front side is gonna look like square because there's no space here it's all covered the top also fully covered so we can draw the box and then start actually this Dropping box button should be equal size. Um, this one will be different, so it's okay. We have to draw it nearly equal, equal, equal size. Okay. Wow, I could use that. Mm, that's a place where you draw these things. Whatever. Okay, let's finish this one. Um, so we have done. We are doing the top side. So two boxes deep. Four boxes longer, and from this one, two boxes deep again. Two boxes deep means it's gonna mean this line. So therefore, it's gonna be like this. It's gonna look like this. Mm -hmm. Okay, so this is going to be our top side. Then, if you want to draw the right side, we have to draw the 45 degree angle. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 10. So, we draw the 45 degree and then we are cutting this one right and here. So I'm gonna draw the right hand side here, it's gonna be a box again. It's gonna be a box again. It's gonna be a box and uh, this one is one box deeper. One box deeper and one box deeper again to And here we go. So this is our front side. So there's no hidden line, nothing. So we are good to go. So for the next one, I can I hope I can use this one. Mm -hmm. This, yeah, I'm gonna draw this one next. Okay, I want to get used to this. I'm gonna rotate this one. Okay, here we go. This is a nice one to create these things. Okay, let's go. Mm, let's draw the front side first. One, two, three, three, four, five, six. So it's five, uh, five, five books longer. I'm gonna draw the five books. One, two, three, four, five, six. Six books longer. And 
one box height actually we can write um, extend it as long as uh, one one two like one two and how long this is three four five six one, one two three three and then four five six one two three four five 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 uh, five books longer and do the four five okay we will draw five box longer and it's gonna be one two three four four box wider box wider and then it's gonna be three box deeper right here three box deeper and then then what happened inclined we have one more side okay So let's finish the all the vertical parts first. So one box height and here we will put in one box. Here we go, here we go to here. Mm -hmm. It's hard to like to draw like this, so I'm gonna draw the horizontal layer first. Okay, here we go. We cover this bottom part. And then let's go to the top. It's one box distance and one box covered like this. And then what? Half box. Then it extends for two boxes, actually one and two boxes. Extends for two boxes and then One box again. Mm -hmm. And it goes all the way down to the air.
Mm. So this is our front side. This is our front side is going to look like. So if I want to draw a top side, let's go to that one. Top side. It's going to be um, five boxes deep. Five boxes deep. And also five boxes length. I see six boxes. One, two, three, four, five, six. Six boxes length. Exactly the same as the bottom. We are making six boxes length here. And then five boxes will be deep right here. Okay, so we are draw this line here. Um, okay, we are done. We are done with this and so now we have to draw the port. We have to separate this thing. Actually, I think it's better to draw, draw just by hand. Okay. So top line, top line is going to be divided into two, two of this, and here it's one box, one box. One box depth, and we are going to cover this like this, and it's going to go all the way to the end. And then what? Here we go. It's divided right here, right here, and then from here it goes like this. After that, everything changes. Make sure the top and bottom match in the distance and uh, things match in the distance. So, this should be exactly straight to this one. Right here. So, we are done with the top part. Let's move to the right hand side. So, I'm going to draw the 45 degree. To the port where it is gonna go like this. Mm -hmm. So from the right hand side, what we see, let's see. This much height right here, this height, and it's gonna go. It's gonna be this much in the back end. Five boxes length. Five boxes length, and uh, this one is one box length. One box deep. Then what happens? Two boxes height. Four boxes deep. Then two boxes of height and then connect like this. So there's going to be a hidden line right here because the bottom part. Um, because the, we have to show the change right here. So it's going to be exactly this point. Exactly this point. 
So that's going to be our hidden line. And from the hidden line, there's something going to connect with this one. Connect to this one. And this part should be hidden. Also, but as we see, so that's all for the left hand side. Also, we have to show this, this one fully going straight, and this one okay, everything is perfect. So, we are done with this one. Let's move to the last one right here. So if we draw the front side for this one, it's going to be 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 6 box deeper, 2 box, 6, 4 box long, 4 box long, Box room, two box depth, two box depth, two box depth, two box And we have to show the this is our this is our circle right here the depth of the circle and we have to show the middle line for that one center line we call it center line so we have to do the center line right here and this is going to be the picture for our front side so if we look at the top side it's going to be one, two, three, four, four boxes deeper and same distance. Mm -hmm. And four boxes longer and six boxes wide. The seven box in the circle is very directly visible, so we can draw a circle here. Mm, what else we have to do? So, this separation right here, right here, okay. Separation is right here, and The bottom part as a hidden line because we can buy this leader. So here we go. We draw the hidden line. We actually, the hidden line goes by the middle of the box. But we have to draw the center line for the book, uh, uh, the surface too. So wherever you see. Uh, any hole you have to draw the center line. So we draw the center line for this one and we are all set. And, uh, let's draw the right hand side. To draw the right hand side, you have to draw 45 degree angle.
Okay, so here it's gonna start two box deeper, two box longer, then two box deeper, then one box long, one box deep. So this is how the shape is gonna look. This is major, this is two box deeper, this is two box deeper, uh, long with these two box longer. I'm gonna actually make it messed up, but it's okay. Um, the surface is gonna be light here. The center line is gonna be like this. And that's why it's there's one hidden part for this. Oh, actually, there's one more one hidden part. Uh, this this is the hidden part right here. So only this one. After that, uh, we are all one more hidden line here. After that, we are all set. This is the This is not the hidden one. After that, we are all set. <laughs> So this is all guys, I hope you guys enjoyed this video, mm, thank you for watching.